I hate you. <laughs> I hated you all through grade school. I hated you more. Well, when I was younger, my favorite things were Polly Pockets, dressing up, playing outside with Lilo's Pet Shops, and Bugs. But when I was younger, my favorite things were Polly Pockets, dressing up, playing outside with Lilo's Pet Shops, and Bugs. But I still hated you. We spent seven years of our lives hating each other, both agreeing that the other was the biggest bitch in school. I mean, why wouldn't I think that about you? After all, you tried to see my best friend in third grade. She was my friend first, but when you came along, I felt neglected, abandoned. She left me for the one person I hated the most. But what fueled that deep hatred? Was it the fact that I loved playing with my little pet shops? Or was it the fact that my dearest memories as a child came from playing outside? Or was it the lack of shared communication that would have revealed our mutual appreciation for these childhood pastimes? It's, it's taken us seven years of petty bickering and childish quarrels to figure this out. We have to learn to not criticize what we don't understand. Misinterpretations of a person's character can demolish a potential friendship. And that's what we all lack. We lack the ability to put aside the difference that we think we have and give that person a chance. You have to take that step forward, come together, and give that friendship an opportunity to flourish. I mean, what's a seed in perfect soil if you're not going to water it? So what changed? What changed that made us the dynamic duo that we are today? Seventh grade. Seventh grade? That was when it all started, right? What do you mean? That was the year we put aside our differences. Overcame our obstacles. We, we came, came to the realization that the other wasn't the black sheep in the herd anymore. We were a part of the same clique. We shared the same friends. Volleyball. Track. Relays. State. We shared the whole experience. And now we're here, eighth grade year, and look how far we've come. It took days. Months. Years. But look where we are now. It, it took some time, it took some effort, but now we're growing together, closer than ever. Is splitting up a part of the plan? Never. So maybe it's time we all stop and realize. We can't criticize what we don't understand. Or judge the book by its cover. Because, because when we do, we miss out on something amazing, each other.